Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Christine. I, I have not filmed a video in a very, very, very long time. I think the last video I did was around Christmas time and it is now August. So um, yeah, I haven't filmed in a while. I actually had planned on after Christmas just deleting, well not deleting, but um, ending my channel, like not posting any more videos because I just wasn't into it anymore. And so now I have come to the decision, I guess, um, to just post videos and make videos whenever I feel like it and not be put on a schedule because one, I do work full time and two, I just don't have an interest in filming all the time and I I'm not very creative to where I can come up with ideas of what to put out there. So just gonna be whenever I feel like filming, when I have a topic to film, and that'll be what I post. But um, today, as you can see by the title, I have a Be Our Guest Express box opening. Um, so today, as I'm filming this video, today is my birthday. So I ordered this box specifically for my birthday. Um, I wanted to open it for my birthday. So that is why I have this box. Um, and the ladies that I talked to about my box were very, very nice, very, very helpful, understanding. I had ordered this box um, August 5th and I had sent them the, an email asking when was it gonna ship when was it gonna get here yada 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 cuz you know I wanted it for my birthday and they told me it was estimated to ship September 4th and I was like if there's any way possible could I please get it for my birthday and that's when my birthday was I told them August 26th they said that there's no guarantees but they'll try to do their best that they can and um, this box actually got here a week ago today, so last Wednesday it got here. And I had my sister hide it from me so I wouldn't wouldn't be tempted to open it. And then I ended up coming up with the idea of her creating a scavenger hunt for me to find the box. Um, so that's what we did. And I'm going to actually start out by showing you the clues and everything that she made for me to do the scavenger hunt to find my box and then we'll get into the actual box so I'll try to be quick so she hid all the clues and all that and I'll start with the first one that she gave me and she did a really good job with the clues and putting them on these cute like pictures so it's a picture of Cinderella's shoe and I'll read it to you because I don't know if you can read it because it's backwards for me but it might not be for you but it says they may not be new but go to the place you would find a shoe and she put it in um, one of the shoes out on our porch and then the next one is this one and it says Mulan is a natural born leader your next clue is in the theater so we do have a home movie theater downstairs in our basement so she hid that down there and then here's the next one it says she's such a cutie go find a bed fit for sleeping beauty and that one was in my parents bed because it's bigger than our beds. Um, and then the next one here, it says, she wanted to be the perfect daughter. Go to the place where we use the most water. And she hid this one in the shower. Well, the next clue, like that, that's where it was in the, sh the clue led to the shower. So then there's this one. And it says, in the place you would, you watch shows, you must find a rose. And she hid this one next to my, well, the, again, the next one. It leads to find the next clue. It is um, next to my enchanted rose that I have out in the living room. And then, so this is the next one where that one leads. Uh, cold like the ice queen, go find the ice cream. <laughs> and it was in the freezer with my ice cream which was this one. This is the last one. It's something that I do and Rapunzel does it too. And this is where the box led was at. 
and she hid it actually up here in the closet next to her paints because she likes to paint just like Rapunzel does. And this is the box. It's so cute. I love it. So obviously with the title of it being Be Our Guest Express and I'm a huge Beauty and the Beast fan if you don't already know that. So I was like I have to try this box out. And I think the box that I ended up getting was the Enchanted Rose box. I'm pretty sure. I can't find the email that I had where it said the box I got, but I'm 90% sure I got the Enchanted Rose box. But And it did get just a tiny bit, I don't know if you can see, a tiny bit banged up here. But I already opened this. I'm going to tell you right now, I already opened this because I wanted to open it and experience everything for myself and not have to worry about filming a video. But I did still want to share it with you. So I've already seen everything that's in here. And everything's fine. The, the box did get a little banged up like I showed you. But everything inside of it is fine. So now let's jump on in. And I already, like I said, everything's I've already seen. Everything's ripped open. So I'm just going to show you. So it has the tissue paper. And it has the same logo as, as in a sticker form on the top. And then also, excuse me, on top I have these. It's a Epcot um, guide map. I haven't really looked at it too much, but my sister opened it up, and it actually is an updated Epcot map where it, ha it even shows like the relaxation stations and stuff on there, which I think is super cool. So I'll have to look at that later. And then also on top is the spoiler spoiler guide. Wow, I can't talk today, but yeah, it's the spoiler, and it's the same. I'm gonna cover my name up here the same pattern as the box so then let me move this guy back over here once you open up the box or the tissue paper then you see the contents of the box so let's see I think the first thing I ended up pulling out was this and as a postcard well that's what it says in the spoiler it's a postcard but it's really just like an art print. It's a, it's a limited edition art. Rapunzel Dancing in the Sunlit Courtyard by Thomas Kincaid Studios. So it's just a Rapunzel little print card. And then that's what the back looks like. So I thought this was really, really cute. Definitely going to frame this at some point and put it up on my wall. Then next thing I opened was... A wishable and this is the snack series parks food series 2 and it contains one plush and then on the back it shows what you can get you can get the cotton candy the turkey leg churros or popcorn um, and I definitely did not want the turkey leg so that's that one I really didn't want I really wanted the cotton candy and I really wanted the popcorn and the one that I got it was the cotton candy so this is what it looks like. It's super soft, super cute. It is a little Mickey shaped cotton candy. Nothing on the back. But it's so cute. And I'm really happy that I got that one because that's the one I really wanted. I don't remember what I opened next. I think it was this. So this, if you've seen this box before, um, you know exactly what this is. This is a Thomas Kincaid morphing mug, heat sensitive. So it's the aerial pattern and I'll take it out in just a second but it's the aerial pattern and it's basically a mug and when you put your hot liquid in it it's supposed to show the picture on the mug so right now it's just a plain black mug and then once you fill it with liquid it will show the um, picture on the uh, on the mug but Be Our Guest Express put a little twist on it and they made it into a candle. So inside of this right now is a candle. It's like a blue shimmery, you can see that. And they have glitter all over this box. So there's even some glitter in the candle. <laughs> but, and it's a wood wick, which I've never seen before. So it's a very floral scent. I'm not a fan of it, but I'm definitely excited to have this as a candle and then once I'm done with it I can use it as a mug and the picture will appear so then next I got a mystery pin box like are you kidding me so this is the BFFs collection 
these are the ones on the back that you can get and this is what I got so I got the Bambi and Thumper And then I also got the Olaf and Sven, which I don't need anything from this pin set because the only two I wanted I already have, um, but I'm okay with that because now I can use these as traders. So yeah, this is the next thing. I have like a piece of hair on my face or something. Oh my gosh. Then this next thing I'm pretty excited about as well. I've never seen this before I watched this watch videos on this box it's an ornament and it's Ariel so it's in the shape of flounder and it's on both sides too um, it's in the shape of flounder and it's Thomas Kincaid Ariel print so that's actually the same print as my mug so this is is a little ornament I can put on my Christmas tree it's so cute. Okay, now we're down to the last two items. Extra paper out of here. This is amazing. It is a Thomas Kincaid canvas of Beauty and the Beast. Like, are you for real? Like, I love it. And it does have on the back the certificate of authenticity. It is so cute and I love it so much. It's an 8 by 10. I'm so excited. I'm so happy. And then the last thing. Is a Jim Shore figurine. And like I said, I already know what this is. But I did not, when I did open it, I did not spoil. I had my sister look to see what side the spoiler is, and I did not look at it. It's Ariel! She's in her pink dress, and she's brushing her hair with a dingle hopper like how cute and this is my very first Jim Shore figurine she's so cute so yeah that is everything that I got in my box so I will go ahead and read the spoiler for you and show you what the inside of it looks like. So it shows all their other boxes and examples of what you can get in them. So your box was packed by, I might butcher this name, I'm really sorry if I do, a brawl, a braille. Actually, I'll just show it to you. Hopefully it doesn't show up backwards. It's A-B-R-A-L. Thank you so much for your purchase. We hope you love it. I did. <laughs> Packing slip for your box. So, the Beauty and the Beast 8x10 Thomas Kincaid canvas was $39. The Ariel Curious Collector Jim Shore figurine was $50. The Thomas Kincaid candle mug was $25. The Tangled Thomas Kincaid, well, I'm throwing things, postcard $5.99. The Ariel Thomas Kincaid ornament is $19.99. The Disney BFFs Mystery Pin Box $15.99. And the Snack Disney Wishable is $9.99 for a retail value of $165.96. Are you kidding me? Yes, be our guest express. Yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. This is the best subscription box I've ever opened in a very long time. Um, actually, it might be the best ever because I've only done a couple other 
subscription services. I was with Magic at Your Door for a long time and I ended up having to leave them because at the time it was just too expensive for me. So then I tried out Bippity Boppity Boxes. Not a fan of them. I'm sorry. I know there's a lot of people out there who love them. Me, not a fan. But this, I'm definitely 100% getting another box. Might be a different size. I don't know. But like, I am getting another box for sure. So, I am going to definitely... And it says, please tag us in your unboxing photos and videos at B underscore our guest underscore express. And yes, I will certainly be doing that because I want to make sure that they know how much I love this box, how much I appreciate them for getting it to me in time for my birthday because I wanted, to, I wanted this to be opened on my birthday and I'm so glad that I got it in time and that I was able to have something to open up on my birthday because... I did get presents from my family and stuff, but we had to do that last night because of things going on today. But, so yeah, so this is like a, an awesome birthday gift on my birthday, and I'm so, so excited for all of my new stuff. Like, I don't even know what to say. Like, I am speechless. I'm so excited, and for sure, getting another box, like, 100%. Like, thank you so much, PR Guest Express. You guys rock. So that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed seeing what I got for my birthday unboxing. I may or may not do a what I got for my birthday video of what I got from my family. I'm not sure yet. That may be a video that I do down the line in a couple of days. I don't know. But, but yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys thought of it down below. And I will see you guys in my next video. Have a magical day. Bye, guys.